there's a bow decoder we're up on the tops I'm just losing the sun a lot of sign but uh, I saw three hinds this morning early no other movement I heard a gun go off so I think Mark could be in because it was uh, sounding his way I'll have a quick snack and head home soon I think Just up from Mo Dakota Hut, where the two rivers meet, and we're in some very, very steep country. The plan was to cross over and uh, go up around the corner to a big slip, but um, That instinct was saying, leave it for another day, it's a bit too much water, so you can get cliffed out very quickly here, so well, I might just go around the corner, there's a bit of a down pine block just around the corner here, and see if I can shoot something on the other side and Get across and back, maybe, or I'll head back and go up Mokai track. Pretty cool though. Long way up there. Wow. Well, I can get down to it. That's not a problem. But it's still pretty deep, and there's not much of a uh, out on the other side. If it gets deeper, deeper over here to get up their bank, which is not going to happen. I'm on a drop off at the moment, but just uh, down to my left, I can get across. But then that is seriously steep going up there and I'd be frickin' wet and I haven't got a anything to make a hot drink with I'd light a fire if I had to but we'll have to get wet coming across back across but it's uh, oh there's our big slip through there so it ends over that side there at the moment in that big slip uh, I think I'll uh, Hang around, have a look at these pines for a bit. They've been cut down. I believe uh, Dave Eaton was in here and chopped all these a while ago. The machine, Dave. Yeah. Have a snack. Head for home. Which is uh, <laughs> back up there, it's not too bad. It's actually a nice ridge. There's a good place to fire camp in here if anyone came to this um, meeting of the streams. It's quite a big flat area on this side. Oh, another day.
Must have been a bit of a surprise and a fucking bonfire and he's left here with no eyebrows so Don't poke a hole in each of those Did you see someone walking around town with scorched marks on his face and no eyebrows? He's been at Otakota? Yeah. 